Today, we are going to compare two popular cameras, the Canon 700D and Nikon D3300. We are going to take a look at their features, who they are for, how they perform in various use cases, user experiences, and which one is the right one for you. Links to both of the cameras will be listed in the description below. Let's get started. The Canon 700D and the Nikon D3300 are two digital cameras that were officially introduced respectively in the 10th of June 2013 and the 21st of April 2014. Let's take a look at how their specs compare to each other. We tested both cameras to assess their performance in different scenarios. Let's take a closer look at our ratings for each of them. Here are our ratings for the Canon 700D. For portrait photography, we will give it a 7 out of 10 rating. For street photography, we will give it an 8 out of 10 rating. For sports photography, we will give it a 9 out of 10 rating. For day-to-day -day photography, we will give it a 7 out of 10 rating. For landscape photography, we will give it a 6 out of 10 rating. Here are our ratings for the Nikon D3300. For portrait photography, we will give it a 7 out of 10 rating. For street photography, we will give it a 8 out of 10 rating. For sports photography, we will give it a 9 out of 10 rating. For day-to-day -day photography, we will give it a 8 out of 10 rating. For landscape photography, we will give it a 6 out of 10 rating. Next, we will take a look at some sample photos from the Canon 700D and the Nikon D3300. Keep in mind that these photos have editing done to them, so the result from your camera might be different. Let's start with the sample photos. Here are some sample photos from the Canon 700D. And here are some sample photos from the Nikon D3300. Next, let's take a look at what other users of these cameras have to say about them. Here's what people have to say about the Canon 700D. I am absolutely thrilled with this camera. It has become an extension of me, and I never leave home without it. I bought the body separately to stick to my budget and have been able to use my old lenses with great results. The 50mm 1.8 lens is a must-have for beginners and takes beautiful, effortless shots. The camera works well with cheaper lenses, and I can't wait to build up to higher quality ones. I have had no complaints and highly recommend this camera to anyone who enjoys taking photos. I absolutely love my second T5i camera. It's lightweight, easy to use, and takes great photos. The image stabilization and flip-out touchscreen make menu changes and video a breeze. It's compatible with all Canon EOS lenses, even ones 20 years old. As a longtime Amazon member, I always rely on independent reviews and try to provide honest and helpful insight. I tend to review products that I really like or that let me down in some manner. If you found this review helpful, please click the helpful link below. Thank you and happy shopping. Here's what people have to say about the Nikon D3300. This camera is a great replacement for my old Nikon D40. The photos are phenomenal and far superior to smartphone photos. The video feature is a huge plus, although the auto-focusing sound interferes with the video's sound. The camera is easy to use and the price is right for the quality of photos I can take. I recently bought the Nikon D3300 and I am very happy with my decision. The camera is well-built, lightweight and easy to use. The kit lens is good and the battery life is impressive. The image and video quality are excellent, and even in low light conditions, the camera performs well. The only drawbacks are the limited resolutions and aspect ratio, and the fact that there is a lot of plastic in its construction. Overall, I am very satisfied with my purchase. To conclude, here are our overall ratings for both of these cameras. Canon 700D, we will give it an overall rating of 8 out of 10. Nikon D3300. We will give it an overall rating of 8 out of 10. 